Hello and welcome to Book Talk. In this book talk, we are talking about A British Girl's Guide to Hurricanes and Heartbreak. So this is a follow-up to The Cuban Girl's Guide to Tea and Tomorrow, which I also did a video for, so go find it back in our uh, past book talks. Um, but this, this is a very different story. So in our previous story, we had Lila, who is a Cuban girl from Miami who goes to England. Well, now we have Flora, who is the sister of um, Lila's boyfriend, um, who is going to Miami to run away because her life, her entire like teen years have all been about the fact that her mother has dementia. And now that she's passed, she feels like a hurricane that is ripping apart her family um, with her selfishness and her inability to control her emotions. So she flees to Florida um, where they were going to go later in the summer anyways to try to figure out what to do with herself, with her future, with all the different things. So she has a boy, Gordon, in England who really likes her, but due to just the fierce emotions of her mother passing and the fact that she has no idea what to do about university, she turns him down and flees and meets Baz, who is a photographer. And since her passion or her escapism from her mother's dementia is taking photos, um, their relationship helps her try to figure out what's next. So if you like a book with lots of emotions, um, if you like having dialogue that mixes in Spanish and English, um, and if you just want to learn about hurricanes and emotions and love and all the things um, in this coming of age tale, then pick up A British Girl's Guide to Hurricanes and Heartache. All right, see you later. Real things up to